We have all kinds of goodies here in the yard at Cleveland Power Performance, and some of those are shells. You probably know this already. Sometimes we sell the shells, sometimes we gotta crush and scrap the shells, but sometimes we have enough parts to make some automotive art. And that's what we're gonna be doing today. Right now, me and Lou are in the back to find a charger shell that we're gonna be turning into a rear bumper wall art. We got a charger Hellcat that it has all the parts we need to get this thing started. So we're gonna give you a glimpse of a start to finish process on that. So uh, let's go pick out the car and let's take a look at it. We're gonna see what we start with. We're gonna see what we end up with. There's a bit of a process involved here. Hopefully it's fun for you and hopefully it's fun for the whole family. I know I'm already having fun. This is like a free amusement park right now. It's a, it's a great ride, it's a fun ride. So uh, let's take a look and see what we got. All right, so I just hop off the loader and before we pick this thing up, let's take a look at it, let's walk around it. So what we are working with is a 2018 Dodge Charger Hellcat. This one was an underhood fire but we got a lot of structure left. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this inside, we're gonna map out where we're gonna cut the thing, we're gonna look over all the parts that are still on it, but it does have everything on it that uh, you need to make a rear bumper wall art. I'm falling into the mud right now. So let's get this thing picked up and let's get it into the shop. And there she is, the prize pig. Now we gotta take her down into the shop to get some stuff cut. I'm gonna hop on the loader and we're gonna roll down there. Now if you guys have followed us and been a fan or a friend, you know that we do a lot of different vehicles in this uh, wall art form. Mostly we do rear bumpers. We do a lot of Chargers, Challengers, Camaros, fifth gen, sixth gens. We do a lot of Corvettes, C5, C6, C7. We've even done a C or if you're looking for any specific rear bumper wall art from any kind of late model vehicle, just let us know. We'll make it happen. We'll make your dreams come true. Get that man cave a popping. Make you the talk of the town and this the envy of the neighborhood. All right, so now we gotta get this thing on the stand so we can roll it into the shop and assess what we're gonna have to do here. Loose setting her down, getting her on the stands, making sure everything's safe and sound and secure. Let's get this thing in the shop start to chop all right we have our charger in the shop and these guys are going over everything making sure that we're good to cut so what they're going to do first is they're going to mark where we're going to need to cut obviously eyeballing everything up we're going to make sure everything's good to go uh are we painting this i can't imagine we're painting it right no no the goal is not to paint it there boss so the, the whole goal here is to not paint it unless of course somebody's like oh i want that exact wall art but i want it in this color and we don't have that color then we'll paint it so if you want a specific color you let us know if you guys have seen these wall arts before, you know that we actually use the actual quarter panel, actual bumper, factory taillights stay in, the actual deck lids on there, we cut it. So we cut everything and make these from an actual car. This isn't a scale model or anything like this. This is an actual factual rear end off of a Hellcat charger. And that's what you're gonna see get created here in the fabrication shop at Cleveland Power Performance. So let's get to work and let's get these guys cutting. Obviously we got some stuff cut up and that's part of the process and that's part of the plan. We still have some more cutting to do like this. We got to trim this bumper up obviously to be flush mount with the wall. We have the whole rear trunk pan area where the taillights mount, 
the deck lid will sit on top of, the rear bumper will mount to it, but all of this will mount to a structure that we make here. And that will come later because we are still working on getting the deck lid trim to sit flush against the wall. And this is, again, these are all actual parts from a Dodge Charger. You can see here, this thing's already about half cut. It's getting the final cuts put on it, but that's our deck lid. We have our taillights over here. We got the side taillights and we have our center taillight. We're gonna keep cutting, keep continuing. Let's go look at the shell that all this was cut off of and see what that looks like. And this is what we're left with once we get all the parts off of the car we need to make the rear bumper wall art. You see it's cut, it's chopped. So that's the charger after all the parts have been taken off and cut off to make the rear bumper wall art. She's gonna go in the back of the yard and eventually she'll get scrapped. And what's next? I don't know, I didn't shoot this out of order. So I, I know exactly what video we're gonna see next, so let's go to that clip. Our Charger Hellcat rear bumper wall art is really taking shape. Lots of parts have been cut, lots of parts have been fabricated, lots of parts have been mounted. But let's take a look at it. Look at this Dodge Charger rear bumper wall art. It is really taking shape. We have all of the parts cut, trimmed to sit flush against the wall. We have our support back here made, and we have uh, you know the exhaust tips are getting mounted. So that's what's happening now. These exhaust tips are gonna get mounted. We gotta do all the wiring so that these tail lights light up, and then it'll basically be done. So next time we see it, she should be in the body shop, lit up, and looking good. And look at that, that is our finished product here from Cleveland Power and Performance when you are making a Dodge Charger rear bumper wall art. That is what we offer for you. Cut from the car, assembled here in house, wired up, bracketry made, exhaust tips on, all the lighting. But wait, there's more on, off, and it even dims. So if you wanna set the mood, you can just dim the lights down on this rear bumper wall art and you have just a perfect accent lighting in that man cave or that garage. If you want to crank the thing up, you go ahead and you hit the up button on the light. Let's take a look at the back of this thing. Look at that. It's all nicely loomed up. We have our bracketry made. We have our sharp edges covered and everything looks fantastic. So this is the final product here that you're left with at Cleveland Power Performance. Rear bumper wall art from start to finish. Cut off the car. So friends, family, followers, and other folks, if you want a rear bumper wall art for your garage, for your man cave, for your she shed, or your other shack, you can give us a call here at Cleveland Power Performance. We'll make one out of a Dodge Charger, we'll make one out of a Corvette, we'll make one out of just about anything that you need. We can make a custom cut creation to fit your space situation from Cleveland Power Performance. Give us a call, let us know how we can help you out. As always, like, subscribe, share, tell all your friends make some purchases, spend some money, and then we'll have fun. Come visit us. Let's have a ball. Let's have a blast. It's Friday today, so all I got to say to you fine folks is happy weekend. Love you. We'll see you soon.